update is from the Just Dance team at Ubisoft Paris. Just Dance 2021 was announced a few weeks ago, but now we're excited to share more of the tracks that will be featured in the game. Let's hear it. Just Dance 2021 releases November 12th and is available for pre-order now. And since waiting sucks, M&M's Without Me is available on Just Dance Unlimited for one week starting today. Our next video is a world premiere announcement. Ubisoft is Guys, we had blinding lights! And, and the second music that was announced, it was Till the World Ends! We talked about Till the World Ends before the beginning of the stream and the coach looks so damn awesome! Oh my god! So wait, without me, we can play it now? Apparently they said it's available today. I was never expecting to have Eminem in the game and then it's on the map like this? Like it really looks like goofy. Oh, huh? The videos are on YouTube! Oh my god! We're gonna watch them all, we're gonna watch them all, we're gonna watch them all. Don't panic. You guys, are you ready? We're gonna watch all the one minutes extract and i'm dying i'm just like the girly team why like i mean we had scream and shout work work by britney why is it a cover like did she became expensive again why oh my god you guys you guys let's go till the world ends let's go the cover is shit Oh, the cover is awful. Yes, like in the real choreo. I'm, I'm like, discover shit. I love this map. <laughs> and, and in between, there's me like, boom. I'm choking. I'm totally choking. Okay, I need to rewatch it, but thinking about the, the real song, like not about this shitty cover. I'm sorry, but it's like the shittiest I've ever heard. <laughs> We're in 2020! You know what I mean? Okay, I accepted the girly team back in 2014. It was okay. But in 2020? Why? Why? And we thought they couldn't do worse cover than Toxic. If you feel it, let it happen. Keep on dancing till the world ends. Keep on dancing till the world ends. I think it's good. I think it's good. If you mute it, I really think it's good. I love her outfit. I love the pink hair. Thank you, Ubisoft. Thank you for putting pink hair to Britney. I take it as a sign. It's for me, okay? I don't care that they didn't think about me while making it because we're millions of players in the world. It's for me. I decided it's for me. I like the fact that they got inspired for the choreo by the original choreo by Britney because, I mean, I saw the Femme Fatale tour like nine times and 
this was part of the of her choreo like in the chorus and even like the jumping like this britney used to do it i don't know if it's in the official clip but i remember she used to do one of these moves it's really futuristic i like the futuristic aspect i love the hair i like the outfit i'm maybe not a super fan of the blue but to be honest i'll take it 100 percent. i think the fact that this cover is so awful that it doesn't help you to see the real map. I like the, you know, the double, triple coach. It's really interesting. I really like it. It's not the sewer, like in the video clip, but I'll still buy it. Oh my god, they put Till the World Ends in the game and the coach has pink hair. I'm just gonna keep on that. Like, they put Till the World Ends and the coach has pink hair. For Britney, I'll give it... I don't like the cover at all. Everything looks fine except the cover. I think because of that, I'll give it a... Wow. Okay, let's go without me, Eminem. my god what did i just watch oh my god chorus is okay i'd say repetitive but i kind of like it i understand the background the background is really comics like bad guy and you know without me it, the, the guy in the background looks really good it looks better in a drawing than in the real coach in my opinion but this part i'm like the coach is on the on the left it's boring like, it's, it's, no but then starting here i start to love it again <laughs> this one is really good i even like that part like the sign i don't understand the outfits with the background it makes sense the coach in the middle it's like a why not in my opinion it kind of looks cool i kind of like the hair it's kind of okay but the coach is like on the side eh. I would have preferred better, let's say. It's like there's awesome things in it and then there's meh things. It's just the same thing as for Britney. Like, it could have been perfect and it's really cool, but some things went wrong. <laughs> the right coach has a duck on his hat. It makes sense with the original clip at least because he's dressed a bit like this. To my taste, I, I still don't like the outfit so much, but it makes sense, so it's fine. Eminem was never featured in Just Dance, and now it's featured on Just Dance. Like, he had to wait for I don't know how many years. The background drawings are, like, badass awesome. For Without Me, Troll is not my favorite kind of songs, but I want to see more of it, and we're going to see it entirely, so I'll, I'll wait for my judgment until then. But, yeah, maybe I'll give it a 7. Wow. Later. Later. My god, I was slayed. I was not expecting this. I'm, I'm totally in. Like, you totally got me. The chorus is perfect. Like, the fact that the chorus is cool and simple enough, you really enjoy yourself. Oh. It was awesome! Okay, so The Weeknd is not the artist. It's the title of the song, Michael Gray. Do I know that song? I loved it! Oh my god! It's Footloose 
Squad Zero, I agree! Oh my god, I was surprised! I was not expecting to like it so much. First, I know the songs and it's a cool one. Dre loves the song as well, apparently. I know it from GTA 4. I love how they're sh they're shaking it like that. Ah, ah, ah. The choreo is really nice. It's energetic as it should be. The background, uh, yeah, it's really footloose. It's goofy, but not stupid it's a choreo to have fun about the outfits i think they're cool both of them are nice i like the colors it's not just you know yellow turquoise pink <laughs> and purple i think it fits perfectly and i can wait for the weekend to begin you know at work makes perfect sense it's really cool really cool it's an old song again so it's really like the retro playlist yeah i'll give it i'll give it a nine nine out of ten for the Thursday stream, it's gonna be the perfect song because it's gonna be I can't wait for the weekend to begin. <laughs> Next one is Samba de Janeiro. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Samba. <laughs> <laughs> is that just what it is? In the pictograms at the end, you you can see that the next move is still the da na na na. <laughs> and they made an entire song with just the chorus. I feel like I'm in Skibidi, but in like a 2.0 version for the choreo. <laughs> I mean, it's a good party song, but it looks so repetitive. About the costumes, I cannot say I would have expected something else. The guy on the left, it, he looks like he's the cousin of the bird of in the Navy. The guy on the right looks like he's the cousin from Taki Taki Out. And the girl in the middle, she's the cousin of drop the mambo a bit and the carnival song the carnival song like ah yeah yeah from just dance 2017 the background is not interesting you know when there's coach that are so colorful fancy in the way that they're grabbing already the attention yeah okay the background is pretty blank but i think it's okay like this i enjoyed it i think it's a good party song i think the choreo fits with the with the map and i think the dancers are okay with the map but am i super hyped no <laughs> i'll give it a six <laughs> <laughs> Run away. Oh, it's it's what Galantis. Okay, Galantis had peanut butter jelly on Just Dance Unlimited and now it's Run away you and I. Why these coach? Whoa, there's so many things to say. If somebody has an explanation, 
about why Power Rangers for this map, I'll take it. Second, the background looks really pretty. This entire map, it's a mix of Spectronizer and Automaton. Because it's stylish. But the colors are more Spectronizer. And at the same time, this moment, I don't know why, For in my eyes, it, it looks super retro, like an old Just Dance. The color is not, like, obvious. The moves are not obvious. It's not like I've seen it a thousand times. It's pretty new, and I like that. The coach, why not? I really like the pink one, of course. Background, background is yes, yes, yes. Song, I really like it. The blue coach doesn't have the same energy as the pink one. I agree with that. That's why the pink one is really catching my attention. I really think it's a really interesting map. I'll give it a eight and a half. As of now, I know all the songs that we watched, and we watched five songs out of nine. Next one is DBDB Sound by DJ Fresh and J Fay featuring Miss Dynamite. It feels like the guys, the coach of policemen, finally got arrested. And then these two guys are taken on the streets and having fun because, yeah, the other ones are in prison. Now we can have fun. We can be the kings of the streets. It really reminds me of the duets we had in Just Dance Kids from Just Dance 2020. Like with the panda and the reindeer. The coach on the right seemed totally lost. <laughs> They're not even clapping in their hands. They miss their hands. It looks fun, though. It shocks me, and I'm, like, kind of blocked, but I feel like it's in a good way as, as well. Like, I'm, I'm kind of confused. <laughs> I feel like I've heard this song before, but I don't know where. I think it's cool. I like the coach. At the same time, I'm, I'm not sure I'm gonna like them forever. <laughs> to be continued. That's all I'll say on this one. Boy, You Can Keep It by Alex Newell. Ah, when she sings it better. Good things don't come to those who wait. Never know what comes in first day. You know what it is, so fade away. I'm sitting in the rain, you'll fade away. So stop. Is that what I mean? You call a heart before we start. Boy, you can keep it. I'm yes! the best with fancy cars on the boulevard. Boy, you can keep it. And if you don't know, now you should know. It's time to break the news. I'm going so low. It's a no go down. when the coach is singing it makes more sense with the character lip syncing is really important like in the drag queen world it makes more sense on the moment like she really gets into the character and you can see her sing the outfit is okay the bow i'm like mm, i really like the hair and the choreo seems to fit pretty perfectly maybe if you knew the song before and if you know there if there's an official choreo or anything it could be disappointed, but I like the way she moves. I like the sassiness that comes out of it. The queen moments, like the crown and the pointing. No, really, I like it. The catwalk, it, it works perfectly. It works perfectly with, with the song and the character, like totally. On the verse, she's walking on the catwalk. And on the chorus, she's arriving on the main stage. It looks like the stage of the RuPaul Drag Race show. I'll give it an 8. Okay, don't tell me the next one is Blinding Lights. I was disappointed by the cover of Britney. This is not a cover. And it was in my top two of expected songs. Give me a good Blinding Lights.
the first part, it's really the best part. It's amazing how after all of those years, Just Dance can still keep on coming with new concept. Like this arm thing, it's totally new. Wow, the background is impressive. So, okay, coach, 10 out of 10. Like, I love her. It's the first time we got a female coach on a, the weekend song, Killer. I love her. She's a killer. She's perfect. Everything is perfect about her outfit. I wouldn't change anything. That chest piece, I love it. Coach, 10 out of 10. Background, 10 out of 10. I feel like they went a lot on the futuristic aspect with Britney, with that one, with Runaway. The only thing I'm not fully convinced is the chorus. Maybe dancing in, I'm going to change my mind. Uh, but the chorus, I was expecting a bit more. They tried to give her a dancing but robotic aspect. There's still some dancing parts. The beginning of the video, it's really dancing. And then on the verse, it's really robotic. I don't buy the robot aspect. I wanted a more dancing one. We'll for sure have an extreme. I totally agree with you. Maybe when I'll dance it, I'm gonna like it better. But still for that robotic aspect that we had to have, apparently, it's gonna be an 8 out of 10 again. Somebody say, I think it's important because it relates to amputees who play the game, representation. I really like that. Let's go for Bailando Paradiso. It's an old video clip, like the old original video clip is passing behind the coach. I love that touch. A lot of the songs of that playlist are really retro, like they're old. But this one, I love the fact that they played on the fact that it's a really old retro song. That background is exactly that. And even the vibe of the coach, the way she's dressed, the way she acts, it's really retro. 2020 is shit as a year. We want to go back in the 80s where everything was more simple. That song is exactly that. Totally embodies that. 2020, don't want to hear about it. Let's go back. I don't know from when that song is. 97 1997 it's like it's an obvious choreo it's an obvious lot of energy screw it i'm just gonna be obviously enjoying myself and doing big moves and who cares nobody's gonna stop me because i just want to dance the costume feels really going with the song if you watch the original clip at one point the singer has kind of that outfit so it really comes from here it's a bop i think it's really good i'll give it a like an eight nine I feel like I just gave eight and nines tonight. <laughs> There's a lot of songs that I know. And I really feel like they went on. Okay, you wanted some old well-known song. We're delivering. Like We're delivering it. It's a playlist of old hits. But it feels right. It feels right. It reminds me a bit more now of the playlist of Just Dance 2017. When there was a lot of old hits. I'm super pissed off about the cover of Britney. Because I'm like, I want to put it as my first. But then there's that, that awful cover. You know what I mean? I don't know. It's too hard to choose. I think all of them are quite good. There's no like, okay, 10 out of 10 perfection. Like we had Dance Monkey. Like we had Billie Eilish. There's no like, blow your mind. Oh my God, perfect. I was not expecting it. Blah, blah, blah. There's always something that's like, it could have been perfect. But overall, it's a very good note. Overall, very good. This is going to be a fun game. I agree with that comment. But I had an amazing time. I hope you guys had an amazing time as well. And I really want to thank you again for joining. For were so many tonight. I was so good to share it together, like to share our first feeling. So really, really thank you again.